I'm walking through, I'm walking through. Tall grass, look at that. Super tall grass, right? And I bumped something. Guess what it is, y'all. Bye, babe. Bye. All right, Avenger Gang, so now that I'm in the middle of nowhere, my main objective today is probably gonna be focused around finding turtles, but I'm gonna be looking for mostly amphibians, reptiles in general. If I come across anything else cool, I'm gonna show you guys that as well. I think I'm gonna focus mainly around turtles because I haven't seen a lot of those so far for the year, but I wanna actually find a little bit more of those. So I'm gonna keep you guys updated, man. Hopefully you enjoy this video. Like, share, and subscribe if you do. But you know what time it is? It's adventure time. <laughs> All right, guys, first snake I saw was a queen snake. Jumped right in here. Let's see if I can get it for you guys. Queen snake slipped by and went probably down and there's a little hole in the water, but just for fair warning, I am around water a lot, so you're gonna see a lot of water snakes and queen snakes and stuff that hang around streams, but I'm gonna try and venture up and see if I can find something else cooler for you guys. Um, so bear with me, man. Water snakes just jumped in the water right here. Man. One came crawling this way online. I don't know where you went. The next one jumped in the water. I'm gonna continue looking for them, man. But I don't know where they went. Um, two water snakes and one queen snake. I'm gonna continue looking, man. That guy went deep in the, the the one that stayed online went deep into that brush pile, and then the next one went down into the water. So I don't know where they went. I'm gonna continue looking. I see some baby turtles over here. And they're a little bit too far for me to actually catch, so. Sucks. I haven't gotten my hands on anything yet. Oh, there's a little pickerel frog right here. This guy didn't jump to avoid me. <laughs> so I was walking down here before and I saw this water snake sitting on the brush pile. But my GoPro didn't want to turn on for some reason, so I'm trying to go back down and sneak up on him. Hopefully he don't spook this time. Dang, that was a big one too. Another giant water snake over there on the other side of this stream, sitting on that log. If I go straight directly to him, he's gonna see me. And plus I saw a different queen snake, but I didn't turn my camera on because it's already in the water when I got up to it. All the snakes that I'm seeing is disappearing before I could get to him. Um, I'm gonna try to get as close, but that one already started going now. Started going now, started going now. Dang it. Dang it, man. I'm not getting to him fast enough. <sighs> Once they hit this water, it's over with. You can forget about it. All right, Avenger Gang. So everything that I've seen has been able to elude me. They just slipped past my fingertips before I was able to grab them. Just a little bit too late. So I'm going to try my best to try and get one in hand for you guys. But... All the snakes that we've seen so far, you already seen in some of my videos, so it really doesn't matter that they got away. I'd have been really pissed off if it was like a king snake or something like that that I have never seen before, and it got away from me, so. Hopefully I can get something in hand for you guys. Um, stay tuned, man. I'm gonna catch something real quick for you. I'm walking through, I'm walking through. Tall grass, look at that. Super tall grass, right? And I bumped something. Guess what it is, y'all. This looks like a little female box turtle Let's see you get her out. look at this guy hey beautiful she looks like she got something on her eye but yeah this is a little fem a female box turtle don't close up yet beautiful shell oh my goodness stunning shell y'all I'm about to try and see if she's gonna come out and take some pictures of her real quick and then I'm gonna bring her right back to a spot. I'm gonna leave my snake stick there so I can know exactly where she came from. I left up there on the road so she could come back out while I'm searching this general area for more box turtles. She started to stick her head out, so I'm gonna take my camera out and take some pictures real quick. So I got all the pictures I wanted for 
this box turtle. As you can see, she went back into her shell. I'm going to place her right back in a little spot that she was chilling at. And I got her. There she goes. Guys, check this out. So I was contemplating flipping this little thingy looking for snakes. There's a box turtle just chilling right there. I'm going to take some pictures with him just sitting like that. And I'm going to try to take him out for you guys to see. So I got all the pictures I wanted of this uh, woodland box turtle. I'm going to try and grab him real quick. I don't know what else is underneath this thing, so I'm trying to be super cautious um, while grabbing him. I'm going to use my snake stick and pull him out because I don't know what else is underneath that thing. You guys, could be a rattlesnake, copperhead, anything. There you go. Woodland box turtle. Super cool. The ways that you can tell that this is a male. First, what I looked at was the eye, which was a red color. Sometimes the females have the red eye, so that's not a definite um, way to tell that it's a male. But then you can look at the bottom. See that it has a concave flash on right there. That's what you want to look for when you come to these box turtles to see if they're male or female, y'all. Um, those are pretty good indications of whether or not it's a male or a female. If you go back and look at that female, you'll see that it has a flat plaster on. And the eye color was not red, so those are the ways that you can possibly tell that if they are male or female. So I'm gonna put this guy right back. Actually, no, I'm gonna raise this thing up first, and then I'm gonna put this guy back in his spot. So there was nothing underneath this thing. I'm about to put this box turtle back in this little spot. There you go, buddy. I'm gonna be on my way looking for more stuff. Little decayers browns. I think this is decayers brown snake. Uh, Avenger gang, I just flipped this little black uh, tarp and came across this little decayers brown snake. These little storias don't get much bigger than this. I mean, they get slightly bigger, but this is a little juvenile decayers brown snake. A little beautiful little snake, y'all. Super cool little find. It's my first ever decayers brown snake, so I'm gonna take some pictures of him. And release him back into his uh tarp hey adventure gang so i got all the pictures i wanted of this brown snake i'm about to put him back underneath his tarp and continue looking for more snakes man all right See you later, buddy. Last little bit of this. I don't see anything. What? This guy's sitting in the... This guy was sitting in the um, ant's nest. This looked like a western worm snake. This ain't like the normal ones that I'll find around here. But you can see that stomach is a little bit more peach than anything else that I ever found. I tell you the difference between a western worm snake and an eastern worm snake. It's pretty cool though, guy. All right, I'm about to release him back into his, check see if anything else in here, I didn't really look. Release him back underneath this rock and keep searching. Alright, guys, so I just found a little dusky salamander. These guys are found mainly around water. And let him go real quick back into the stream. There he goes. A little fence lizard trying to suck up the the heat on this rock. And I'm leaving right there. I flipped this thing thinking just like, it's just piece of trash or whatever. But there's a black racer, y'all. I'm gonna try to grab him. Yeah, he saw me. 
You tell me. <laughs> These guys like to bite. First poop, dead roll, then bite. So it's pretty cool. He's in shed. It's like he's just going into shed or coming right out of shed right now. But I didn't think anything would be underneath this thing, man. I was just flipping, walking along the way. Didn't even think much about it. And flip this guy right underneath that. That piece of um looked like a television. So dope, y'all. Look at that black razor. These guys are so fast, man. Super fast snakes. That's dope. <laughs> Alright, I'm about to release him back underneath this little thing. See you later, buddy. Go ahead. There you go. Sweet! That's dope, y'all. I just walking past. I didn't even think anything about that, man. Getting a little bit darker than I would hope, so I'm gonna try and make my way back up to the road. Keep you guys updated if I find anything else, y'all. So now I'm at the car wash with my fiance. I think it's been a pretty productive day today. I found a bunch of different stuff. Um, wide variety of animals. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate all you guys that subscribe. Having my first um, 100 subscribers, and I really appreciate that, man. It's easy! Yeah. Watch the lights, y'all. Watch the lights. I always come to this car wash. That's so dope. I think it changes color with the, with the wash you got.